Hi Gemini. Welcome to a love reading of yours. This is going to be your weekly love reading. This is a general reading guys. This may or may not resonate with every Gemini watching this video. Some of the energies of the cards here can be flipped. So feel free to switch those energies, vice versa. Time is fluid as you know. You could have dealt with this energy or will be dealing with it in the near future. Um, if any of you need a person reading, that information is going to be down below. This is for my Gemini's in love. Let's see what's going on. All right. Wow. Overall energy. We have the Ace of Cups with the Two of Swords in reverse. Gemini, you're in love. Uh, this doesn't look like a uh, new love to me. This looks like a reconciliation to me. It's more like something you had to make a decision about something. Okay, you could have been um, stuck in your head for a very long time. It could be like a choice that you had to make. Okay, you could have been stuck in your head for a very long time regarding making a choice about a person. Okay, or just a situation. You could have like you were like refusing to see the reality or you were just not sure if you wanted to take that leap of faith. OK, and now finally you see things for what they are. You see this very clearly. And what you see clearly is that the Ace of Cups that you love someone. OK, so, yeah, this could be a reconciliation. This could be a renewal in love. All right. So whatever have you. All right. Let's see. Let's see what's going on with my Gemini's. definitely made a decision what happened in the past three of swords in reverse like i said right you could have gone through a breakup a disappointment a heartbreak separation but you're healing from it okay you're getting out of that the current situation three of cups in reverse either you're trying to buy some time alone you're wanting some alone time you're wanting to be on your own or i think you're just um it could also mean that you're saying no to drama okay there could be a lot of people multiple people trying to influence you or your friends family whoever trying to influence you or too many people involved okay in giving you some advice or suggestions i think you're saying no to everyone else but what I also see is that with the three of cups in reverse here, right? I feel that there could have been a third party situation, but you are choosing one person and you're letting go of a third party situation. Okay. You're ready to make a choice again and again is what I'm hearing. But again, uh, the three of cups in reverse can also mean that you are still not ready to come in terms with the person. Okay. You guys are still not being able to come to the same page because, um, Again, with the separation, I feel that there's been a lot of bitterness between you and the person you're dealing with. Okay, so again, it's very hard for you guys to come together yet. What's on your mind is the seven of cups. So yes, I think you are very, very confused about the situation. Okay, I'm getting you don't know which way is the right way to approach this situation or this person. What is the root of the issue? eight of pentacles in reverse so now i feel that there is now you are ready to make this happen you're ready to work this shit out you're ready to go towards this person with a renewal i think you were the one who was the one who did not put in the work before okay you weren't investing into this relationship earlier or into this connection i'm feeling more like a situation ship um now it's more like you're the one who wants to put in the effort and the person that you're dealing with they've copped out there's someone who's backed out completely, like completely gone to ground zero and just not ready to put in the work. That's why it's being so difficult for you to come into, you know, to come back, um, you know, into this relationship or come back on the same page with this person. What's in the near future? Page of Cups. Yeah, see? You have, I mean, you have communication coming in. Someone wants to apologize is what I'm getting. Again, Gemini, this could be you. This could be the person you're dealing with. So take it how it resonates, okay? But yes, there is an apology coming in. There is a renewal. Someone's ready to open up. Someone's ready to express their love. And someone's ready to be vulnerable is what I'm getting, okay? What you're doing right now is the Ten of Cups in reverse, okay? So yes, this is a situation that is draining you out completely. It could be you, it could be them, but there is a person here who is not feeling the connection right now. But again, there's someone who once felt you were their end all be all. They see, they saw you as their happily ever after, but this time someone's not feeling the connection. It's almost like this, or this could be someone who's already dealing in a third party situation. And there's a family situation that is draining you out or draining this person out, or this is just you who's completely unhappy right now without this person. Again, because there could be a third person involved here. Or there's just a lot of confusion here. 
what's coming in your environment is the two of pentacles in reverse see someone's no more juggling you could very well be dealing with someone who is very very indecisive someone who just lacked clarity or they were constantly juggling you with two people or just juggling the entire idea of being completely in with you or completely being out this person could have been friend zoning you for a very long time all right they're very clear about what they want but it's like by the time they're clear about what they want, I think this person took a lot of time to be clear about what they want. By that time, it's almost like for you, the entire situation has flipped. A situation that made you very happy, a person that gave you the Ten of Cups, made you feel like they're happily ever after. This person doesn't feel that connection anymore. See, however, however, with the Four of Wands, this person still wants that commitment with you. This person still wants that stability, security with you. It's like this is... In, in their emotions they feel like you're their twin flame okay this is 11 11 this is the twin flame connection the likely outcome wheel of fortune so yeah things are 100 percent going to go in your favor gemini for sure you're going to get the ball rolling okay for sure this is an amazing reading let's clarify where's the ace of cups could be dealing with someone okay who's the emperor in reverse okay so you could be dealing with someone who always always wants the upper hand Okay, so yeah, I hate to say this. Yes, you have a renewal in love. Yes, there is someone coming in with this offer of love. But again, there's someone here in your environment, again, who wants an upper hand or you're just dealing with someone who's just very, very stubborn, very stubborn. Okay, this person operates from their ego. They're very hard to budge. But yeah, for them, it's like my way or the high base. I feel this person is very, very determined to have this new beginning with you in love. What is the Emperor in Reverse? Why is the Emperor in Reverse? Whoever's coming in, they're emotionally very unhappy without you. They're draining, they're very drained without you. You make them happy, Gemini. You make them happy and they're coming back for their happiness. But what I don't like is their attitude of how they're coming towards you. This person wants stability with you. They want order, stability, structure with you. I'm getting their approach towards you is wrong. I'm feeling this person never never really knew how to approach a relationship or this person could have been someone who's never really been in a real relationship or a serious relationship, okay? That's why it's like the love is there, the feelings are there, the emotions are there, but this person just doesn't know how to express it correctly, okay? Or they just don't know the right approach to make towards you. What is the Three of Swords in reverse? Where's this Three of Swords in reverse? Let's see? someone was trying to get away there was a lot of deception i'm getting that there was someone here who was trying to who was emotionally very very unavailable or someone who was just emotionally very manipulative i'm getting someone who was offering you scraps they were offering you the leftovers they were not giving you the real deal okay so yeah someone who was very non-committal and they were trying to run away or get away from this commitment very deceptive energy i'm not getting cheating but i'm getting someone you know who 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 broke your heart and now you're trying to heal from that situation and whoever this person was, right, they were very deceptive in the past. Deceptive again, I'm saying not cheating way, but someone who withholds a lot of information or someone who's just not open emotionally, okay? We have the Knight of Cups in reverse. So someone who doesn't want to open up vulnerably, okay? They don't want to open up, express their emotions. They have a lot of love for you, but that's just how they operate. They're not the best persons, they're the best person to open up. Again, I'm getting this person could have had issues in the past that they were dealing with they could have dealt with a relationship where someone really fucked them over and now they're so shut off okay that they just don't want to open up and that's why they knew they love you they knew there was a lot of emotions but probably they were scared they were afraid and they were trying to get away from something solid something stable something committed and that's why the breakup or the separation all right uh what is the three of cups in reverse in the current situation what is the three of cups in reverse However, there is clarity coming in. It's almost like, you know what, I'm getting someone is going to be, there is going to be some new beginning. There's going to be a new beginning here. But whoever this is, right, someone's coming in with clarity here with the Ace of Swords here. I feel there's someone who's coming in with clarity about cutting out a third party situation. Or there's someone who's just very, very determined or have on clearing the air. There is communication coming in. What is this communication? Try for the Ace of Swords in reverse. I think that's still time is what I'm getting before you guys come into reunion. Why Ace of Swords in reverse? 
Or is the Ace of Swords in Jewels? Ten of Pentacles in Jewels. So I think someone is um someone's not settling for less. Gemini, you could be very, very clear about what you want. You're very clear about wanting a commitment, wanting stability, wanting security. And I'm getting that you are not going to settle for anything less. With the three of pentacles in reverse here, I feel that there is someone here now. I think I'm getting the tables have turned. You know, now it's going to be like a one-sided situation. It's going to be like there's a lack of effort, lack of commitment, lack of um, investment from someone. Okay. See, that's why the Eight of Pentacles in reverse. Someone's not investing into this connection. And probably that's the kind of clarity that there is going to be some cultural communication again, which I'm getting, right? But it's almost, it's more like a harsh truth is what I'm getting, that I am not ready to reunite with you. I'm not ready to be with you unless and until I get the entire package. If I don't, I'm ready to walk away. And this is someone leaving a third party situation, or this is just two people still not being able to come on the same page. What is the Seven of Cups? What is the Seven of Cups? You're not clear. So you're not being able to move forward. Right now, things are at a complete halt and a standstill. All right. With the Knight of Pentacles, you're in reverse. But again, with the star here, I feel that you look at this person as a star. You put this person on a pedestal. Okay. This person is someone who you've always dreamt of, but it's a very fated and a very, very destined connection. Okay, right, Gemini? I think divine timing is at work. But if you're confused and you're very overwhelmed right now, I think you dream of being with this person a lot, okay? And uh, you have a lot of faith and hope in this connection that things will work out. But again, right now, I think that there's still someone here who's not pursuing or chasing this, okay? Someone who's very, very slow moving and the reason that you're stuck is because you just don't know which is the best approach. Maybe your approach towards this person is not correct or you just have too many ways and you just don't know which is the right way. You want this person for sure, Gemini. Why is the Knight of Pentacles in reverse? You love this person. Again, you want a reconciliation with this person, okay? Because after you guys broke up. But there's someone who's holding a grudge against you, Gemini. You've left a bad taste in someone's mouth, okay? Something really got messed up. And you're hoping that things will be okay. But right now, you're moving either... I don't even think you're moving right now. You're just completely at a standstill because you just don't know what to do, which is the right move towards this person. You don't know which is the right approach. But you have a lot of faith and hope that things will work out. You want a reconciliation with this person. But again, someone's holding a grudge against you. Someone's clinging on to bad memories. All right. What is the Eight of Pentacles in reverse? What is the Eight of Pentacles in reverse? Someone has a lot of fear of the unknown, all right? With the moon here, okay, no. Also, what I'm getting is with the moon and the Eight of Pentacles in reverse, there's someone here who's trying to bury themselves in work and they're suppressing their emotions. You could be dealing with a Pisces, doesn't have to be, but um, there's someone here who loves you a lot, but they're choosing to suppress their emotions because they have the fear of the unknown. Maybe this person has gone through hell and back with you or in the past, right? And now this person is just not ready to put in the work because they're lacking fear of reciprocity. You didn't put in the work before and they're not sure if you're going to put it again. That's why they've completely backed out. They've backed out from the situation. Absolutely. And now they're suppressing their emotions. They've just, it's like they've had like a veil in front of their emotions. Okay. It's like a curtain in front of them. And now you can't just see through whether this person likes you, whether they love you, whether they still want this with you or not. That's why the confusion here. That's why the confusion. That's why you don't know if you should move forward and pursue this person or not. But it's on your mind. Why is the moon here? Why is the moon here? This person's living in a lot of stress and anxiety. Why is the moon here? See? Page of Wands in reverse. This person is lacking the motivation, okay, to talk to you, or this person is just not sure if they're ready to step up the role. I'm getting more of lack of communication because this person just the, the, the passion is dying to initiate a conversation okay but also it could be someone you know who's just is it could be someone who's taking things too seriously but yes i think whatever has happened 
it could be something that needs to be taken seriously okay but again but i'm feeling this person is again in the dark and they don't know because you're not putting the work right or because you're they're not putting in the work there's a lot of confusion here okay seven of cups the moon a lot of confusion there's a lot of gray is what i'm getting okay a lot of gray area there's no black or white there's a lot of gray area here. that's why there's a lot of unsurety about communication you know it's like someone wants to communicate but they're holding back on purpose because they don't know if it's the right time to take action or, or they should uh it's the right time to talk about something okay but well regardless you have communication coming in with the page of cups clap for the page of cups someone's coming in with clarity with a page of cups and the king of swords okay so there's someone there's some flirty communication coming in more than flirty i'm getting with the king of with the king of swords and the page of cups i'm getting someone's wanting to come in and apologize but you my friend are going to deal with this in a very very logical manner or it could be the same person who's finally ready to open up emotionally they're coming towards you they're wanting to apologize for whatever they did in the past and they're going to come in with truth and clarity but it could be that you are probably in your logical mind you're operating from your logic and you're going to cut this person off it's like no i don't want that lame ass apology of yours see there's a delay in a new beginning here because someone's doubting this themselves someone has a lot of self doubt can i make this happen will it will this be possible what is the king of swords what is this communication what is the king of swords what is the king of swords yeah see i don't think you're going to be able to make a decision i think you you're going to need some time out when this person comes in and apologizes to you i think you're going to be like you know what i need some time to talk i need some time to think about this because this person definitely wants everything with you but i think there's going to be a time out with the four of swords here you're going to take some time out and think about this What is the ten of cups in reverse? Yeah, this is a situation that is draining you out completely. But again, you're very, very obsessed with this connection. Okay, it's like no matter how much this drains this drains you out, you're obsessed with this connection. It's an addiction. You just cannot get through it. or it could also be that you know that this is a situation that is draining you out emotionally but again with the devil here you're feeling very stuck tied and bound to this person or situation what is the devil i think there's someone here who's reevaluating the entire situation like i've invested so much in this relationship is it worth it is it worth my time do i need to wait and watch and wait for this to come to fruition or should i just let it go completely a lot of patience a lot of patience this is a relationship which is going to progress very very slowly what is the devil it could also mean one more thing i'm getting is that the someone is stuck in a family dynamic here they're unhappy but with the devil here they're very very stuck they're unhappy they know it but they just feel very stuck tied and bound to this relationship or this other third party family okay whoever this is what is the devil yeah over the two of swords in reverse here i think there is going to be a decision this person is going to make a decision okay with the queen of wands here i think this person is going to be very sure about what they want and they're going to go get it this person has a lot of confidence in themselves okay they know what they want this could be someone very attractive and amazing personality like they're like out there you know they know what they want this is the queen of action okay so yeah this person is going to take action and very soon they're going to be clear about what they want they're going to make a decision because i think this person is the one who needs to make a decision about what they need to do this could be someone who's presented with two very unpleasant choices okay like between stuck between a rock and hard place but yeah this person sees things very very clearly that something is very very toxic and it's making them very unhappy what is the two of pentacles in reverse what is this two of pentacles in reverse this is the rose and the rose and the rose okay the judgment fell out 
this person wants a reconciliation whoever is they, they were juggling you they were not sure if they want this or not but they want a second chance with you with the judgment here this person is no more crying okay this is someone who could have been very very focused on um this person could have had a lot of fear of rejection okay because they could have been rejected in the past so this could be someone you know, who operates a lot from their ego also okay but yeah this person is no more in that state anymore with the four of cups in reverse here they're wanting to move forward and they're no more uh focused on what went wrong okay they're ready to focus and ready to take up new offers because they realize the more isolated they are i think they're missing out more opportunities with you what is the judgment what is the judgment I have the judgment. Oh, with the chariot in reverse here, but still this person is very, very stuck. Very stuck. It could also mean that Gemini, the person that you're dealing with, they could have been very much in their head. They were trying to juggle a decision of whether to stay with you or not. And probably this person has finally made a decision of not moving things forward with you. Okay, Gemini with the chariot in reverse here it could be because i have the four of pentacles in reverse where they're ready to release something this person could have held on to you for a very long time okay but now they're really ready to release this situation and with the chariot in reverse here but they feel very stuck they feel very stuck clarify the four of wands clarify the four of wands this is four of wands what is this four of wands someone's letting their guards down this could be someone who was very very defensive someone who had a lot of trust issues with you gemini okay or you could be this could be you gemini who had a lot of trust issues with someone okay maybe you had a lot of trust issues when it came to committing to this person okay but now you're ready for this in your emotions you want to commit to this person and i think you're giving up you're not fighting this connection anymore okay it's like for you it's like you know this is your twin flame it's destined it's fated okay and with the magician here gemini that's you virgo gemini you are hell bent on making something happen you're very determined on making this happen you're ready to take action yeah because you see them as your as your soulmate we have the lovers here you see them as your soulmate you see them as i mean there's a lot of love here it's almost like gemini you know who you love you want them this is a very spiritual connection a soulmate twin flame connection if you believe in it but yeah you're you're ready to put your guards down you don't want to fight this again i'm getting you don't want to fight this connection anymore again gemini you're very very unhappy without this person you're obsessed with this person okay this is obsessive love and now you're ready to see this connection for what it is okay you're no more fooling yourself but this person that you're dealing with right it could be that it's too late because this person could have been waiting for you for a very long time but this person finally is making a decision and whatever decision they're making right things are still not moving forward i don't see them walking away but yeah something stuck here okay with the chariot this person could be living at a distance from you all right but yeah something still stuck here something still not moving forward because this person i'm getting they the, the willingness and determination to fight for this connection is over within them because again i'm getting there was one person here who fought for this over and over again whilst you didn't and now this person is completely copping out and now you're the one where you know you're getting that awakening and now you're ready to do this always happens doesn't it what is the seven of wands in reverse because you have a huge realization with the tower moment there's a huge realization you have like an epiphany almost like you know what there could have something could have happened okay and you just realize like oh my god like i want gemini or they realize i want gemini this is the one i want to be with this is my twin flame this is my soulmate this is the one i want to spend the entire life with this is the person i love that's why you're letting your guards down you're no more being defensive because you had that tower moment the tower is also like a person transformation but although more than a person transformation it's more like an aha moment okay it's like an inner realization that's what you've had and now you want this with this person awesome all right why is the wheel of fortune here is the likely outcome things moving your way gemini 
What is the wheel of fortune is the likely outcome again but the problem here is that someone's very very shut off emotionally unavailable king of cups in reverse now you're again now you're dealing with someone who has trust issues only you had trust issues now you're coming back to this person realizing um uh, that it was not them it was probably you who had trust issues in the past with whatever you had right but now this person is very very emotionally unavailable this person doesn't trust you gemini you want things things will be your favor okay but again it's going to be very hard for you to open up this person because this person's emotions are completely unstable they they're finding it very hard to trust our intuition this time again they don't trust you because whatever happened happened and now they just have a lot of issues again with the moon card right here they're suppressing their emotions they have the fear of the unknown they just don't know where this is leading to that's why they stop putting in the work it's a very burdensome situation with the 10 of wands here and again this person could be ha again having a very hard time trusting their intuition they're trusting their logic this time okay and it's a very burdensome situation it's weighing them out something's very overwhelming for them you know it's a very draining energy why is the king of cups in reverse they feel very backstab and betrayed by you gemini very backstab and betrayed or gemini you could have felt very backstab and betrayed by them okay but still with the knight of swords and the knight of wands here okay someone is rushing in not only once does someone want to have a conversation they want to lash out they want to say everything that they've held done to all this while and it's going to be very 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 passionate communication this is someone who's very passionate about you gemini or this could be someone who's very pa or you're passionate about someone else right but again you're dealing with someone who's feeling very backstab and betrayed by the end of all this okay maybe it took too long maybe it was karma playing off and things were just not working out or maybe you took too long to come in and apologize to this person or vice versa right but um if you want to get the ball rolling gemini you'll have to work hard for this you'll have to work hard because you're dealing with someone who's just emotionally shut off this person has trust issues like i said they don't trust you gemini because they feel very very backstab and betrayed by you. You want to make things work out with this person you're going to have to be like we I saw the magician so yeah that's cool but yeah. You're being too slow Gemini if you're the knight of pentacles in reverse. You were anyway slow moving. Now you're in the reverse. You're not even chasing or pursuing this person aggressively. I think the knight of swords and the knight of wands, right? This needs to happen. If you want this person this needs to happen but we don't want the knights. because the knights are still in and out right your energy again your approach towards this person wanting this person is very wrong we don't want knights we don't want pages we want the king right someone who's stable someone who doesn't come in and out in and out in and out okay that's one of the reasons one of the biggest reasons why there could be issues okay trust issues so anyways gemini i hope this reading resonates with you like share subscribe leave your comments below and i'll see you next time bye bye